So in this video, we're going to talk about hyperthyroidism and reducing some really big uh, side effects that come with this condition, especially the ones that relate to the heart. So if you have this condition, this is going to be very, very important. Even though it's going to be a very short video, very simple, very, very important. Okay. When the thyroid is in hyper mode and it's overworking, the demand for B1 greatly goes up. Why? Because B1 is the spark plug that allows fuel in the mitochondria, in the cellular factories, to be converted to energy. And the thyroid hormones connect to all the cells, especially the mitochondria. So we have this situation where we're burning up all the B1, and it's the deficiency of B1 where you get all the heart complications. I mean, just look up beriberi, for example, and look at how that B1 deficiency affects the heart. Beriberi is a B1 deficiency. So some of the symptoms from a hyperthyroidism would be congestive heart failure. That's a big symptom. Left ventricular ejection fraction. Cardiac hypertrophy. The cells of the heart actually enlarge. Dysrhythmias. So you have all sorts of uh, problems with the rhythm of the heart. And B1 deficiencies were detected in 98% of patients with heart failure. So if you also have a heart problem, B1 is what you need to take. I would recommend the whole complex, not just B1. And I would definitely get a natural B1, not the synthetics. So you want to get nutritional yeast for both of these conditions, whether you have a hyperthyroid problem or even a heart problem. And you will notice a great improvement just by taking that simple vitamin. Go ahead and try it out and then comment below. I want to know your feedback. So if you're enjoying this content, go ahead and share it with someone that could really benefit from it. 